like to thank everyone for coming out today to recognize Mill Creek Valley, experience the powerful work of art, Pillars of the Valley, and join in the community collaboration that has brought us together today. Every place has a history, and this is part of ours. What happened here in our not so distant past, 64 years ago today, the Mill Creek Valley neighborhood was demolished scattering families and their neighbors across our region. The fact that this community was almost erased, it was just about gone. This is like being restored to history to me. I mean, that's who I'm doing it for. That's why I did this, it's for them, like people that actually lived here, for them to get some vindication and some validation because they was purposely moved out. I lived at 328 South Garrison, 3221 Laclede, 2649 Bernard Street, right off of Jefferson. We need to understand where we are working, what happened in the past, what the community needs now, and what the community's vision is like for the future. I've always managed to maintain ties to Mill Creek. Even after we moved out and even after I was grown and married, I ended up moving back into the neighborhood. Humbling is the best way I can put it. When you see somebody that can live the life and the place that they come from is finally getting recognized. In addition to the sculptures, the landscaping along the south side of the stadium shows the plot lines and addresses of some of the homes and businesses that stood on our stadium footprint over 50 years ago. Sheer physical presence makes it impossible to ignore. As permanent as it's gonna be, it's literally cut in stone. So it's a, it's a big deal. They're being etched in history. Our first goal is to listen. And I'm so happy to be among the people who told us their stories today. Memorializing it now, it just means all the world to me. It's an important way for me to make sure that those stories, and those stories of which I'm a part, are not gonna be forgotten.